is Queen Nisha, and in today's video, I will be reacting to bring to episode 7 and 8 of Squid Girls. Let's go ahead and get started on episode 7 in 3, 2, 1. <laughs> Take 2 and 3, 2, 1, go. There we go. <laughs> I'm sorry. I I'm sitting here laughing about <laughs> what is possibly going to be my torture for the next week <laughs> about looking at my work schedule. <laughs> I made a stupid little joke. And I'm like thinking in my head, what if it comes true? And I'm like, <laughs> oh, that would be hilarious. And then I'm going to make a face and be like, what? <laughs> Please don't let that be true. I swear to God. It's so funny because, like, you can't tell right now. I am tired. Like, I've been home since I got off at 6, 6, 6.30. I got home, like, 7, 7.30. So, I ate dinner. <laughs> And because of what I ate, I had Chipotle. I I was so tired after I ate. And I was like, I'm going to lay down. And if you follow me on Twitter, I was like, mm-hmm. I need to get started on this stuff. Then I was like, fuck it. I'm going to do it tomorrow. And then I go out. I talk to my mom. And I'm like, you know what? <sighs> Let's get this done. Even though I'm probably not going to be done until midnight. And I got to go to work tomorrow, too. Inca's adorable. She gonna show up, ain't she? Oh, but Inca gonna make her grand appearance. And there's Inca. <laughs> well, technically, she kind of lives with him. You know, the look on your face, baby. <laughs> yeah, basically. mean oh my god <laughs> all right let's get started mm. yeah you deserve it Inca! <laughs> Where are you gonna sleep though? <laughs> All three of them in the same damn room. No, no, no. She she sleep. It ain't a part of her plan, baby.
Is she sleepwalking? Yeah. Is <laughs> she wanting to watch TV? Heck, I love the fact that, you know, you could just connect your headphones to that. Most TVs did that. Now you can connect it with Bluetooth, so, you know, hey. But the one thing about connecting it with a Bluetooth, there's always a delay, which sucks. Well, she was trying to stay up to make sure he didn't do anything. <laughs> Inca! <laughs> oh, Inca. <laughs> well, yeah, but she just wants everyone to fear, you know. You take it one day at a time. <laughs> yep. Like by the end of this series, like send me. It's just gonna be like, you know what? I give up.
No, Cindy. See, there's always a fucking deal breaker. No. Bond, see, didn't that seem a little too easy? But I feel like, you know, because of course, Inca, she has a plan. Sometimes her plans don't go the greatest, but you know, that's okay. That's Inca, right? <laughs> Where I go. She's right. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Mm hmm. I knew you were going to have to go. That. Okay. Um, oh God. Oh, I thought, you know what I thought it was? You know how like with some series, like, okay, The Hunger Games, when they put in like a tracker inside of someone, oh, I thought that was, I was like, oh shit, they about to track the hell out of her. Dang, his eye though. <laughs> They're saying this. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, I thought you would have a little bit more. So you telling me the one thing that you had that cures cancer, you didn't give it to everyone so that everybody will be cancer free? See, also, the these four right here, they have the cure to COVID as well. We just don't know it. Mm. 
Inga, you so gullible. <laughs> Right? So you are? Oh, he's cute. Oh, damn. Oh, it's her! So, why haven't you told your dad about that? No. Oh, okay, so she's like Futaba from Persona 5. Right? Yeah, I mean, I, I get it. You know, hey, you know, if you have social anxiety, that's fine. I'm not bashing anybody because, you know, hey. Hmm? Seriously? Well, yeah, because the people at your beach really like Inca, so, I mean, I think that would be fine. Bye! That's all you want her to do? Can't she just sit?
She's so adorable. This child, oh my god! Seeing her do that drum solo. Mwah, like, oh god, you know, when you go to a concert, a really good band concert like Paramore, or maybe Panic because the Disco, it just depends on, like, you know, what type of rock music you like. Um, and you just hear someone go off on the drums. It's so good. So, so good. Ugh, like, but this is a very interesting episode. I love the fact that, you know, Inca and, um, the other girl from the rival beach, they got to switch for a day. And just to see that, yeah, both sides brought in customers in different ways. One was just for entertainment. Well, in, no, in a way, they both were entertainment. Um, one was for a gazing eye, and the other one was like, oh my god, look at what she can do. She looks so cool doing this is on the third. But, okay, also with Nagisa, like, pretending that she's not afraid of Inca anymore when secretly she still is, that <laughs> was fucking hilarious. Oh, my God. I, I literally could not. <laughs> but it was a very good episode. Fucking hilarious. How Cindy and her three other scientists who cured cancer... Once again, where the fuck were you guys when COVID was that bad? Honestly, where the hell were you? We needed them and they weren't here. <laughs> oh my god, damn. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I don't even want to know what the heck happened in the preview. But yeah, like I said, it, it's so funny to realize. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um,. I also love the part. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, so I like the part where um, <laughs> Nagisa. <laughs> Nagisa's like, I'm gonna stay up all night. I'm gonna watch Inca, and Inca, you know, wakes up in the middle of the night. I'm gonna play a video game, and no wonder. Like, she's like, Yeah, why am I so tired? Like, that reminds me of like one time when I was like, I need to get stuff done. So. I had did an all nighter, recorded all that I needed to record, and then start. I finished around like I think ten o'clock. No, not nine, ten o'clock. Six o'clock in the morning. And when I finished, I went to sleep. I was gone, and I didn't wake up until about two o'clock in the afternoon. My mom was like, "So yeah, I was your all nighter." I was like, "It's the worst thing ever. I never want to do that again." Oh my god. And also, it was for a Patreon show. And I was like, yeah, I never want to be in that situation again. 
Ooh, excuse me, oh my god, and here we are, I'm probably going to be in this situation again, but I should be done by 12. But, I mean, yeah, this was a very good episode, I liked it. I hope we get to have another moment where these two get to switch and go to work at different jobs again, because, of course, it was very interesting. But go ahead and pause the video, and I'll see you guys in one second for episode 8. Alrighty, episode 8 in 3, 2, 1, go. Mm -mm. Oh, one part always up oh, there it is yeah this one always wants to stay up I hate it Will they grow back? She's not feeling good. Possibly. Possibly like a summer cold. Oh, damn. Oh, so that's how you check your temperature there. Well, yeah, I used to have to do that when I was a kid. The what? Yeah, you just get some sleep.
babe, you need to eat, like, some porridge and then get some sleep. Exactly. You need something that's going to help your body. No, like shrimp, shrimp. No, no. Poor baby, she's so tired. Yep, don't give in. Uh oh. Oh, uh, uh, what? Ooh. Yeah, it does.
Well, technically, that's more of her head slash, you know, her fins. The fact that you just now noticed? Damn. I mean, it worked, though. It seems like that, Nakisa. Mm hmm. But she just uses her tentacles. <laughs> I'm like, I'm sorry, she got bitch slapped. <laughs> But, I mean, hold up, you get cramps after a while, so I, I don't think that's going to work, baby. <laughs> Damn! Yeah, but she hurts herself in the process. <laughs> no, they're kids. Let them be kids. Are you going to blow it away?
I'm so. Got a bump on my nose. Uh oh. Ooh. Mm. The umbrella. Inca. <laughs> there you go. No. Yes. No. <sighs> Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh. oh, the smaller one, yeah. Ta-da! Is that supposed to be Echo? <laughs> I cannot, bruh. <laughs>
she always bringing attention to herself. Rest in peace to the G. Come on, let's get you a new one. <laughs> yeah. Mm hmm. And you need water. Let me guess, we're going to see... <laughs> I figured we would see the umbrella and the ending credits. Uh, even though it's broken, homegirl, Inka's like, I'm going to use it. Inka, mine too, we're going to use you to the end, baby. <laughs> okay. One sings Sonic, just it's a shrimp once again. <laughs> No, can we just talk about the long pause? <laughs> that ship was everything. Oh my god. Like, bruh. Because it was just like, oh shit, what the fuck am I doing? <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I'm crying, bruh. <laughs> I can't with this show. I love it so much. Oh my god. But having Inca <laughs> play with the umbrella was interesting, but yeah, rip to, you know, Inca Mark II. Rip to the G. You get a new one, baby. <laughs> That's like the time where, okay, so I had bought this umbrella. I loved it so much. It was a smiley face one. And this was my senior year in high school, and I was at this chorus banquet for my school, for my chorus. I thought I had it with me when I left, and I realized that I didn't, so I had to call my friend and be like, hey, did you see an umbrella? Well, as of, this has been almost now 10 years later, never got that umbrella back, and it's okay. There are better ones. I've seen really cute anime ones. Like, I've seen one that looks like, um a sword. Um, I've seen really good nice artwork on them. I do like the ones that are plasticky um, and that it's clear because you get to see the water drip off of them. I think it's really pretty and like that aesthetic where you can take pics with it and stuff. It's like, oh, like yes, look at me. I'm singing in the rain with my cute little umbrella and stuff and twirling in it. Like, I think that's so cute, especially when it's little kids playing with it. Like, oh my god, I'm like, like, I'm not gonna adorable. I'm gonna cry. Like, oh my god. But, I mean, <laughs> rip to the G. I mean, she tried, and we all knew that there was no way. Like, the damage was already done. There was nothing else that she could do with the umbrella. So, I, I hope and pray <laughs> Inka got a new umbrella. Hell, I feel bad for her because she's like, oh, like, I'm getting wet. And it's like, it's okay. It's fine to get wet with a little bit of, you know, half of your body on the, on the, uh, I'm sleepy, under the umbrella and the other half just like, you know, out in the rain. It's okay. It happens. <sighs> Excuse me. To all of us. And so it's okay. And plus, you know, babe, you are a squid. You need water. You need that. After you got sick, ma'am. So, you know, I, you do what you gotta do. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode seven and eight of Squid Girl. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel and make videos every single day. Join the Natural Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all <clears throat> next. W yeah. Mm -hmm. 
next Wednesday for everybody else and next Saturday for Patreons for episodes 9 and 10. Bye, guys.